So until we can chime in. So can Dave and who else was it? Uh, yeah. 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 So we looked at this because it's such a, there's so many different things that can happen in a uh, general open discussion. And as we were working through the cards, we just had a, had a pile of cards on here because all of these things felt like they apply. And then started looking at, okay, what are the key elements in this and what are the key roles? So the, there's the facilitator, the participants, and then sort of the reason for coming together, the core uh, uh, purpose. And the facilitator, the real main key pieces of that facilitator is to support the you know, moving towards alignment, particularly in a consensus-based decision-making uh, process, which is, I think, mainly what we're, we're working with here. So we looked at what are the key aspects of the facilitator, setting intention, trajectory, um, season timing, uh, right size bite, and, you know, setting the, uh, seeing the forest, um, seeing the trees, holding space, distilling, all being very much with these three aspects, you know, coming and in, entering into the process depending on what the conversation is about. So divergence and convergence, uh, appropriate boundaries, balance proce process and content. Meanwhile, you know, holding, holding the space, holding the container. And that the, the reason for being is to come together in a circle that there is an implied trusting the wisdom of the group, um, that, that the, the purpose is to inform the group mind and to move towards alignment. And the participants <coughs> need to be, uh, to have a group culture. There, there, there needs to be some kind of uh, agreements about how they're going to be behaving in that, that context. Um, the, the good faith assumptions and that uh, uh, shared airtime are all aspects that support the, the uh, general open discussion with taking responsibility at the end for, uh, for the results. And then all of these other aspects are sometimes included in there because general open discussion can have so many elements mm -hmm. in it. So you've got um, all grist for the mill, common ground, um, I, I don't know my glasses. Mirroring. So mirroring. Um, Embrace dissonance and difference. <coughs> Go meta, challenge, not about you, harvesting, and deliberate. Yeah, so it's like depending on what your meeting is about or how the process dynamics of it unfold, then those yeah. may or may not come in, kind of. Mm -hmm. um, I might explain those ones a little bit differently. I feel like part of why those other, those facilitator ones ended up up there was that like, um, it's really tricky because um, like for me, you know, one or two of those might be core, but for some other facilitator they might not be. And so a little bit like, you know, if there's ones that were core for some of us or not, that was part of how they ended right. up in that little fan up there. Yeah. 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 All right. I've got a question. Oh, yeah. I just got an interesting Oh, did you say you yeah. oh, Just a question. Oh, oh no, it's just what I... Um, so you would not recommend this for a public facilitation process? It, the, the group culture piece, is the is it really critical to the success of a, of a plenary? Well, you know, it, it ends up being something... There needs to be some agreement is the way that... So is there another card for that, well, group I, culture? Well, and I, would have, uh, I would have said group culture was in it for like a slightly different reason. I'd say there always is a group culture. Every mm -hmm. discussion, every meeting that happens has a group culture, mm -hmm. and that group culture supports certain things and it restricts other things. Mm -hmm. And so like in some, you know, in some okay. group cultures, it might be taboo to name names, let's mm -hmm. see. Mm -hmm. And then that's really going to affect how it unfolds, mm -hmm. you know? And right, then like right. in another group culture, there's a, you know, something else that happens and that affects how it, so it's... Yeah, I see. Yeah. I, I think that your way of looking at it is actually uh, fits more. With the, and there ends up still being also, which maybe is not that card, but agreements about how people, like there's you know, they hold up a, a right. right card, it means yeah. something, right. or, you know, right. that sort of thing. So right. there's that right. piece of it. That could be and they, well. they need, yeah. to, have, yeah. need yeah. to have been informed of that yeah. in order for the process to work. Mm -hmm. Right. And, and that's part of the appropriate boundaries, too. Yeah. Yeah. I just, like, wasn't, when I was just tuning into <clears throat> it, um, at first I was thinking, um, Wow, it's very hierarchical. Look at participants on the bottom holding <laughs> up the, you know, holding up the meeting, you know. 
But um, then I started thinking that when you use the word agreements and things, I see that it's almost more responsibility on the facilitator. And so it, that balanced out my thinking that, you know, there's this, you know, mm. participants on the bottom kind of thing. You know, but I have like, my social justice issues. <laughs> so this is where I look at things. But it's kind of interesting how, you know, there is this emphasis. But of course, we're all coming from a, more of a facilitator viewpoint here uh -huh. today. So, well, that's actually, probably why there's emphasis there. You know, one of the things, though, I mean, looking at it, looking at it from that perspective, because I wasn't looking at it, mm -hmm. my tendency would then take the facilitator right. and put it on the, the bottom, bottom. Yeah. Right. and then put the participant on the top, mm -hmm. yeah. which I tend to always do yeah. in all of the diagrams that yeah. I have of the, yeah. the, you know, the well, the group being, well, no, but, yeah, that's right. Well, or maybe the yeah, reason, since this was the core, like, we were doing this, like, center of a yeah. circle, but right. yeah, yeah, that's yeah. on top, if that's the overarching... Yeah, thing right. that's controlling it, maybe this line belongs on top. Mm, the you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah, but it's just, I'm yeah. just interesting the, how we lay yeah. things out. I, yeah. 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 I, love it is. I love looking at how you go, it's like, here's the core structure, like, here's how it always is, and then there's this piece around the other facilitator, you know, extra kind of competencies or focus on their, right. this area, and then all of these, like, mm -hmm. these are the things that yeah. often will kind of insert themselves into that. Yeah. yeah. It's, yeah. it's a neat way to map. Two, two other comments on this one. Just really brief. One is that uh, even with this line, like I still feel like it could be distilled down even further sure. potentially. That this isn't necessarily feel done. Mm -hmm. um, oh, I totally forgot it. Oh, the other thing I was going to say is that someone asked in terms of methodology of how we do method mapping. Someone asked about like once we have in out in one of the earlier groups, like okay, we put all our cards out that might be the most relevant, and then like should we sort them into category? And it was like, I don't know. So what I noticed is like, I wouldn't sort them into category at that stage, but often if you do a chronological layout, yeah, that's where you'll it. notice yeah. that the rainbow mm -hmm. order starts to come out a little bit. Mm -hmm. I, you know, it's not surprising. Oh, interesting. Yeah. 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 You can see that there for sure. <laughs> yeah. 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 Somebody used this term, uh, uh, agreements. And I think that's, a, that's really interesting to pursue. This idea that in a lot of these events, in addition to specific roles and specific processes and things that are, uh, activated during a meeting, there are these tacit agreements uh -huh. that are implicit uh -huh. to the event, yeah. Yeah. which uh -huh. have a very strong effect on it, even yeah. though they're not explicitly stated right. or invoked yeah. in the yeah. 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 yeah, and and, uh, and sometimes completely unconscious. Mm -hmm. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Depending yeah. on the culture, perhaps. Yeah. Yeah. Or, yeah. Yeah. Like, understand yeah. a little bit so long. Yeah. Yeah.